hi guys you're welcome to this video where i'll be showing you how to get access to figma pro for absolutely free so figma pro allows you to do some extra features that you don't get in the starter plan features like um, unlimited files and folder advanced prototyping um advanced library and all of that it also makes handoff to developers um seamless right you could also add some extra features like video to your design your carousel design all of that so um if you want all of this feature it's going to cost you 16 dollars per month that's about 192 dollars per year which you always renew every year right but in this video i'll be showing you how to get it for absolutely free right and you save yourself the extra cost so here's how you do it um when you check your figma interface it looks like this You're on the free plan if you click on view plans um if you come to this route you are going to pay this amount but let me show you how to buy cut that amount so go over to a new tab and type figma figma for education figma for students so you come over to this figma for education free tools for classroom click on it it's loading just give it some time all right so this is what it looks like so once once you get this interface of course you should be signed in right this is the name of the account i have on this tab you can see it right so all you just need to do is click on get verified free best in class tools for classroom so click on get verified It's going to take you to apply right education apply so you're applying as a student or as a teacher right in the design space all right so when you see this interface you click on students of course ensure you are the one that is currently signed in right your email your correct email so i'll select i'm a student what type of institution i'll select bootcamp then um what are you applying for i'm applying for um free study okay why are you applying to study to study so you do why to study and complete my design training so what's the name of your school you may want to choose your school name or you choose this school i'm putting in this video so i'm choosing my own school name i'll choose river state so i'll just choose this then what's your primary field of study of course you want to choose user interaction right they are going to ask you to upload your bootcamp receipts this is what you should do come over to a new tab and type if you are using this school type um river state university river state where free receive slipped pdf or image anyone so i'll just click on it go over to images then select any nice receipt i'm seeing here so i think i like this one that is same paid even if it's not river state okay let me just use the one that has the river state logo I think it makes more sense um okay let's work with this let's work with that i'm liking this one that says paid even if it's not a logo all we just need we just need a single pdf to do that so i'll click on this one that says paid and copy that receipt
So I'll copy this receipt like um, download savers. So I'll just advise you choose your school or you choose this particular school I'm using. Then follow the process. This is a website, it won't work. Let me look for normal image. Let me just use this on that school logo. All right, click. Save images. Okay, this is a JPEG file, so I'll just type bootcamp. You see, that say I18 and click on save. Once that's downloaded, you see it downloading. I'll go over to that place, check if it's downloaded. It's done. So I'll just come here, choose file, and select um, bootcamp receipt. Um, of course, I'll go to download. So um, they will ask you to share the link of the course you are taking. That's another hack. You go over to Udemy, just type um, your yeah, yeah, design course. You dare me. Then you come over to just click any of the link like Figma Essentials or Top User Experience Designer course. Let's use this one. So I'll just I just need the link, right? So I'll copy this link. This is it. So I'll just copy the link. This link here, copy it. Control C. Go over there. Paste the link here. Then when are you expected to graduate? I'll just choose December and the last day, 2027. I agree, I agree, submit. Look at it, you are in, you are now verified, you are now verified with Figma for education. So um follow this step to unlock all the features in personal plan. Um click on blah blah blah. Just go to Figma, create, upgrade, and join. So I'll go to Figma. And um, check it out. So if I even go to this place now and reload it. I think this one is also loading. So once it's up, you notice that it's no longer on the free plan, so you can now explore to the highest level, right? Just use Figma as you wish. But it's loading. I want you to see it for yourself before I stop the video. So that's just how you um you move from free to pro. So you see, um, so they say choose a team. Look at what they have now. You are now a verified educational Figma, blah, blah, blah. So I'll just click on next to create a team. Almost done. Then I'll agree. I see now it's not cost zero instead of $16 per month. So I'll just click upgrade, complete. All right, I'm in full time, full time.
so we've created a folder so you want to create your team name i'll just put peace creating you don't necessarily need to add a member at this point so just your name is enough so that's going to be all for now if you are watching this video and you don't have a figma account i'm going to attach a video on how to create your figma account at the end of the video so you just go watch it create your account then make it pro and enjoy the rest of the tutorial if you are yet to subscribe to my channel please like the video and subscribe to the channel so when i create more videos like this you would benefit as well so i'll just keep this for now Wait for free. And voila, that's it. We're in, we're in, we're in, we're in. So at this point, there's going to be no more restriction. All clear, right? You see that, so uh, please, you can close this, not necessary. You don't have to create a team. So that's it, I'm in. If I go on my um, new project, let's say I'm on draft, and I create new design. From this point here, let me just end this video at this point so I don't make it too long. But once you've done that, you are in. I create new file, and that's it. Design.